person. He was born on Christmas. If he wasn't born, we wouldn't have Christmas. He was the king of the Jews. In the Bible, Jesus did lots of miracles. Jesus was not selfish. He helped people who needed help like sick people. He was a kind and generous person. Jesus died when he was 33 years old. He died for our sins. He didn't do anything wrong. Hold on, stop your music. I'm wondering, what was Jesus like at school when he was my age? Sing a song to him. Do you want a bit of snowman? Come on, let's go and play. I never see you anymore. Come out the door. It's like you've gone away. Um, we we look stunned and happy, and we'll be crazy, and we'll be shaking people's shoulders like crazy, like this. I'll run around the school as a as fast as I never run, calling Jesus is here. I would take him to the canteen, get him an icy pole. The canteen ladies would be really nice to him. I think he'll break up a fight, like if people were fighting, he'll um, break up the fight and probably the other people who were having the fight would probably hang out with him. He would, I'm pretty sure he would help others with the, with their work, not just, uh, not just tell them their own answers, like one plus, like one plus one is two or something like that. He'd let them figure out their own answers. After he finished playing with his friends, he'll go along, see if anybody else needs some friends, and he'll ask them, do you want me to play with you? They'll say, yes, please, and then he'll play with them. If I fall off the monkey bars, he help me up and take me to the nurse. I could slip off and I could hurt myself, and Jesus would be the first one to help me there. He would be the kind of guy who will help people in the monkey bars. If you don't know how to do it, that means you might break an arm. That's bad, bad, bad. Jesus, in my opinion, would be humble and normal like the rest of us. He would fit in with us in class. I would show him to Mrs. Franio, Mr. Deeth, Mrs. Layton, my friend, teachers, Mrs. Prescott, in Barrows, Mr. Neagle. Oh, just for everyone. Jesus would make sure that people will use their equipment properly. I would really like skipping, but I just can't do it, and it wouldn't be fair. And then after a while, Jesus comes and encourages me. I'd feel really good after he encouraged me. I'd be a little confused if Jesus came to our school. I'll probably scratch my head and wonder if that's really him. I'll have to take a closer look, and then I'll realize that it really is Jesus. I would ask Jesus, have you been to other schools before? I'll be really interested if he has. And if he has, I would ask him, can you say other things that, that you've learnt during your life? I think he would lead, lead us in prayer and um, I think he would pray with us. He would teach us how to pray. Yeah, I think he would. 
he would wave to me and um, I would be shocked and so happy that he actually waved to me. Um, I would say hi, not knowing it was Jesus, then I would um, oh, be shocked and, oh. and then I would he would teach me how to be a good friend and tell me the character first program and he would probably know all the statements and in the right order. Um, help people on mathletics, especially with that silly hyphen, seriously. He, um, I don't even know how to say hyphen, it's pretty hard. If Jesus came to DCC, he would have really neat writing. Jesus will always do his best because the teachers will really like it when we do our best. I'd faint, like my eyes are playing tricks on me. I'd just go like, is this? I would just stand for a minute and just faint. I'd probably faint. Seriously, I'd be like, oh my goodness. I'd eat food with him, but I wouldn't talk with a mouthful, because it's true. I bet there will only be healthy food in Jesus lunchbox. Like carrot, banana, apple, grapes, mandarin, orange, tomato, mushroom, whatever. We would greet him with a happy and nice greeting like, um, Hi, my name's Poppy and this is Samantha. I would ask him if he would like to play hide and seek. I'll say, Hi, Jesus. You want to go play hide and seek? Yeah, well, it would be pretty good at hiding, so it won't be really a good idea to play. Um, he would be just so awesome at mathematics, but he wouldn't brag about it. His name would be at the top of the website front page, and you would, but you wouldn't see it unless you found it for yourself. Isn't it? Interesting. Jesus did things that we can do. As God's people, we can be like Jesus. We can help others as Jesus would have. We can put others first like Jesus did. We can be a light in this world. I can be like Jesus. I can be like Jesus. I can be like Jesus. You can be like Jesus. Everybody, absolutely everybody can be like Jesus. Jesus? Let's ask him. But don't eat that. 
Um, if three people were, were having a fight, Jesus would break up with it. I would be a little confused if Jesus came to our school. I don't know that <laughs> Yeah, we need the lines. Um, we, he would, uh, he would say, he would, we would, he, we can give me something again. <laughs> Pretty confused. And probably know all the, uh, what? This is the first time I tried to I can't say. I forgot what he said. Do you have the DCC? I'll say, like, my eyes are playing kids for me. I'll try it again. Jesus would. Jesus would. Uh, what is that? <laughs> I would ask Jesus, have you been to other schools before? And. Oh, I forgot the next thing. <laughs> I forgot the next thing. Okay, Matilda, take two. And. Matilda, take four. Matilda, take four. Okay. No, I don't it. Okay. Okay. Just say. Matilda take five. Matilda take six. Six. Matilda take seven. Matilda take one, two, two. Take, take 147. Matilda. Matilda, if Jesus came to DCC, what would you do? I would ask him, have you been to other schools before? And he says, yes. And I'll ask him, I'm probably interested if he said more things. And and I ask, can he say like more things you've done before? And he says, well, I probably will. I've been to lots of schools before. In my life that I seek, give me faith. Sustain me, cause I know you're always there.